All right, the second test we're performing here is very important and very interesting because it shows, I believe, the true potential of this building material. Um, the ambient temperature today is about 31 degrees. If you look over here, I've got a thermometer placed in the sun, uh, the direct sun this morning on the east wall. It's coming in about 35 degrees, 36 degrees. Now, I'm, now I'll take my infrared camera and I'm going to scan up the wall. The temperature reading in the center, the temperature reading in the center, uh, excuse me, the temperature reading you see on the top is the temperature reading right in the center. So you see we're about 75 degrees. And I also want you to look at the color. Very consistent. If this was a building with steel beams and concrete block infill, the steel beams would come out, you would read the pattern of the steel beams being hotter than the concrete block. This is very consistent because the outside surface is, is a simple coating over foam insulation. So virtually there's a 40 degree in Celsius temperature difference between, uh, between the ambient air, the direct measurement at the wall itself, and the temperature, surface temperature of the wall. Now let's go inside and see how <coughs> much the temperature is on the inside of the wall. What is the temperature on the wall externally uh, right now? 70, the highest reading I saw was 74.8. 74.8 centigrade. Centigrade. Is the external temperature yes. of the wall. So we go inside and check at the same location, what is the temperature inside? Correct. Shall right, we go? Yes. exactly opposite this spot. Okay. Let's make it move. Yeah, you don't have, don't you want to cut? Uh, edit? No, I just <laughs> want to make it live video because right. the people will well, be able to okay. understand. So I'm not changing the settings on my camera, and we're going inside now to get the reading. We are at Davza at Dubai Airport Free Zone Authority. We are at a place uh, at the uh, G Plus Two, a commercial building plus a warehouse for Hawk Freight Services in Dubai. We go inside at the same location from where externally we have uh, taken the image. Thank you. You. <laughs> we need to. You might have to cut, I don't understand. <laughs> They this was have. open a minute ago. Zerva, if you can please help us to open the door, please. Okay, somebody okay. has come. Thank you. All right. Did you want to start again from there? Uh, no, it's all right. You are. You are. Right. Now we're entering the warehouse itself. So we have come to the exact same location. Yeah. There you see the door being set up, the fan door. And we were, we were looking at the wall. About here. Okay. So exactly opposite of where we were outside. The temperature, 15, 16 degrees centigrade. This means that there is nearly a 60 degree difference between the inside and outside. What we're going to do in this, in this uh, test procedure, we're going to compare the stated U value of the ICF product with the actual measurements received here. We may even find a higher U value than is, than is stated in their material. I'd also like to get the, here, cut, stop for a minute. Kate, can one of you guys get the, the green thing? Sorry? 
Oh no, give me this one. Give me the uh, give me the wind thing. All right. The gray one. Yeah. So externally, it was uh, seventy-two. You said, I believe. Seventy-four. Seventy-four. Almost seventy-five degrees. Okay, Extremely. and inside is fifteen degrees centigrade. On the wall. On the wall. The ambient temperature inside, in this air-conditioned warehouse space, as you can see here, is about twenty-four degrees. Because that the door is kept open yeah. for a long time, you know. Yeah, yeah. but. Exit door is kept open now for the last one hour. Okay. So you know what? We'll do it again when that door is, when we have the fan sealed there. Okay. But, you, but, you're able to retain. What, what, what do you set your, uh, uh, temperature? We have temperature 90s. 